Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Swolfton Estate. We're going to be doing some cool missions. And by some cool missions, you know what? We've been a little bit on the slow side lately. I think that we go ahead and grab ourselves a little bit by the nuts and go in for a boss. We finally got the cove leveled up, which means we finally have a cove boss. And it comes with a very interesting trinket. Mercurial Salve looks bananas. If we can get this, dude, the courtyard's going to be so much easier. So, for this mission, we brought a level zero, <laughs> which I'm sure is going to be totally fine. Uh, and uh, let's see. Moves back one, blights. It's melee. It blights for two points for three rounds. It's not thrilling. Um, puncture bypasses guard. I like that idea. But let's go ahead and get the uh, stance dance. We have Impale. Pierce bypasses guard. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I like this lineup. Like, this lineup's good. Oh, what do we have here? Sandstorm. Can't be marked. Self only. Plus 15% prop. Plus 15% max HP. That's going to be great. Has the ability to wound care. That's good for camping. So we've brought our new level 0 shield breaker, Monfique, with us. Considering the uh, stunning display of the first one, I'm hoping that this will be more of the same. We have, uh, and I just realized, like, she's going to do a lot of damage if she manages to get in there. It's just, <laughs> wait a minute, we can't bring her. I mean, we could, but it's a bad idea. It's a terrible idea. Nope, out, out you get, you're a kofo. Never mind, we're not bringing her. Which means, oh no, can we not do the boss? Hold on. We do have another. She's got minus 5 accuracy for range skills. That's really bad. Wait, okay, what about you, Neville? What you got? You know what? Let's bring Neville. Welcome to the team, Neville. The thrill of the hunt. And the promise of the payment. Promise of payment. Yes, okay. So Neville's going to be in the second row. In the trench. We have actually have a team name for this. Fantastic. Uh, for our trench man, I think that uppercut makes a lot of sense here. Finish it makes a lot of sense. Come hither makes a lot of sense. Collect the bounty makes a lot of sense. Like, this actually works pretty well. Uh, let's go ahead and, uh, where's Monfique? So that way I can get rid of her two trinkets. You shouldn't have these any longer, I'm sorry. Uh, and sort by rarity, please. Thank you. All right, Monfique, go away. Uh, I'm a little annoyed that I didn't notice the cove phobe part before, but here we are. Hopefully this works out a little bit better for us. Let's see, plus 20% stress healed while camping and plus 10% scouting chance. That sounds great, but we really need something to make our damage a little bit more stellar. So, uh, do we have that anywhere? Does that exist? Plus 2 speed, it's not awful, but like, I mean, it doesn't come with a downside, but it doesn't come with a really good upside either, so... Mm, no? <laughs> Let's just do Dismas's head. Uh, we can heal up a good chunk of that stress. We're now doing a little bit more damage, and I'm hoping that that works out for us. Uh, do you have the ability to mark targets? The answer is yes. Good stuff. And it de-stealths. That's important, considering that stealth is actually a thing in this game now. Which makes sense, I think. Um, instead of having Plague Grenade here, let's have Disorienting Blast. Yeah! Yeah, I think that this works. I think that this works. Now, because you are a level... What level are you? Zero? Um, you've got access to all the gear you're going to need. And I'm actually tempted to put on Flashbang instead of something else. But right now, we can use all of our abilities. So actually, we're good. Yeah, well, let's go. Let's let's boss fight this one, okay? We've got all the trinkets we could possibly want. Some some HP and some, you know, virtue. Excuse me, chance. Here's hoping that Vitalis can actually make that happen. we got some damage and some scouting, which is going to be helpful for a boss. We've got our one-two punch with our Plague Doctor to just make him really good. And then, uh... We got super heals with no stress downside. Hopefully that works for us. We're going to need to bring a couple, like three bloods, I guess, just to be safe. So that way we make sure we've got enough for our buddy here. Uh, let's grab two stacks of food. Two shovels. One and a half stacks of torches. Actually, speaking of half stacks. There we go. That ought to do the trick. Grab a couple of medicinal herbs, a couple of bandages, a couple of these. Uh, and a couple of keys. One key. Please, thank you. Oh, please, thank you. All right. This should be fine. This should be 100% okay. One hopes. My lofty position wasn't always accompanied by the fear of office. Oh, that's good. 
And there was a time when I could walk the streets or raise a glass in the tavern without concern for molestation. Faithful as the tide, one precocious village waif made it her hobby to shadow my every errand. It was charming then. Troublesome later. Oh, spooky. I always wondered what became of the unfortunate little waif. Well, the unfortunate little waif is what's going to be awaiting for us at the end of all this. So, usually a good tip when it comes to boss fights is which is the farthest room? One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, so this is three-way. We got one, two, three, four, five. I'm expecting it's left then. So that's where we're going to go. Sex contents are ours. Thank you. Um, waiting to be might as well pop that blood right now. So that way he's not wasting away from it or anything like that. That's, that's kind of nice. He's got bloodlust. <clears throat> Excuse me. He's got bloodlust, which means that uh, hopefully... We can slap some people if anything bad happens. Oh no. The message has a lasting impact on the hero. Hard noggin. Oh baby, that's actually really solid. You're like super resistant to stuns. You know, for a bloodlusty weirdo, you're actually alright. <laughs> okay, nothing here. Let's continue. This might be a shorter mission if this keeps up the way it's going. Oh! That's nasty. Uh, that's a really big debuff as well. I'm not thrilled with it, and I'm tempted to use medicinal herbs. But let's see uh, how many rounds just passed. Like a couple. Wealth beyond measure, awarded to the brave and the fool. Like, can we actually make do without this? It's. You know, let's try seeing what happens when we leave it on. Maybe. Oh, hello. So we've got some bad guys. And we've been surprised in exactly all the wrong ways. Alright, well with that mentioned, that sucks. How do we deal with this? We need to get Rampart, we need to get our uh, dude right out back to the front. He can do this, but it's gonna, it's gonna screw with things for a little bit. Bad stun. Alright, you can mark people and start getting people killed. I suggest that we do that. Let's mark him. Good. Next, if it's the bounty hunter anytime soon. Okay, you need to move forward twice. Then you can rampart next turn. Uh, in the meantime, you can actually collect the bounty on this guy. Easy kill. And, alright. Not a complete waste of time. Uh, our play doctor is never going to dodge anything, so just keep that in mind. Barnacle barrier. It's a problem, especially because we don't have our shield breaker to help deal with this kind of crap. I'm a little annoyed that we, never, that we didn't really get the chance to do that, but... Like, with this, she would have taken, like, easily 30-something... Uh, in terms of uh, stress there. That would have been awful. So I'm glad that we're avoiding that, more or less. Alright. Uh, can we get a finish him on that guy? Not at all, unfortunately. Come hither. Uh, we can pull this guy forward. It didn't work at all. Because he hit the other guy, of course. Um, okay. We could weird reconstruction. The bleed isn't super bad here, because he can just heal himself if he needs to. For now... Uh, let's look at this. Blight resist is nothing at all. Let's go ahead and start blighting him up. This is fine. We're actually in a really good spot here. We can easily handle whatever they've got going for us right now. So, this is all good. Sea Breeze. Oh, no. What? Oh. Ooh, ooh. We need to kill this guy. Uh, could you pull him forward, please? Oh, my God. Right? He's being guarded. Piece of shit. <laughs> that's, that's actually really frustrating. Uh, okay. Retribution. Hit the guy in the far back. Mark yourself, and let's hope that these reposts are big. Ah, goddammit. I mean, out of all the people to hit, the bounty hunter's actually probably okay with this. Uh, let's see. This is a bunch of damage against stunned. This is a bunch of extra damage versus humans, which none of these are. They're all eldritch. Um, we could just start trying to collect the bounty on this guy. Knock him down a peg. Make sure that nauseous... Uh, Stuff ends up actually doing something. Oh, yes, please. Yeah, a good slap. He's dead already. Okay, you might be bleeding, but don't worry. You won't be bleeding for long. A momentary abatement. That just prevented a ton of damage. <laughs> Stress wave. See if I care. Oh, I'll get slapped. <laughs> Seaward slash. This is fine. So this is the best. Oh, my God. This is the best repost we've ever seen. The very best repost in the world. He just killed the entire party, the entire enemy party, in less than a second. 
on his own. What a beast! But a victory nonetheless. All right, collect all that stuff. I'm feeling really. Oh, the scout's good. All right, go for two. Go for two. It's not for two. Okay, we can go for another battle here. So that way our camp feels a bit more worth it, and that way we get a little bit more loot. I'm actually okay with this plan. I'm, I, I'll, I'll risk it. Ooh, that's a lot of fish. Um, retribute, please. Spearfishing's bad. Especially when he still has that debuff. Spearfishing's bad. But he can handle it, because he's actually, you know, a little bit tougher than he looks. Even if he's stressing everybody out, that's okay, as far as I'm concerned. Collect the bounty. Ooh, good kills. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, You can move back twice. Let's do that immediately. Oh, please. Oh, yeah. That feels good. All right, with that mentioned, we can just cut him. So that was easy. Um, Now we need to start clearing these corpses. We have two ways of doing it. It just depends on which one of those jerks goes first. We can also retribute on people. Oh, we can just slap a guy. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Spearfishing. Could you stop, though? <laughs> Please? Any day now. All right. Um, All of this is kind of bad. We can go for finish him, though, on the back. Confidence surges. So now there's three corpses. I need one of these two to actually go next. Uh, heal him for big. Yeah, that's a big number. I like it. You resisted the bleed, too, which is nice. And disorienting blast. Boom. No more corpses. They're all gone. And you're at the front. And you're stunned, which means you're not doing shit, which is great. Heal up the bounty hunter. Good stuff. He's bleeding. It's not the worst. Um, crush him. Now, if the bounty hunter goes first, we'll have no choice but to kill him. If he does not, we can actually prevent a lot of damage here, which we did. Good. We just effectively healed him for eight, which is awesome. I, I like, battlefield medicine is surprisingly good. Like, very, very surprisingly good. Their formation is broken. I couldn't be happier about how that turned out. All right, so we've only got four rounds left of whatever the f that is. Um, this, Eerie Coral. There's something odd about this coral. I'm wondering if this is the one I think it is. Um, flawed release does not fill me with a great deal of happiness there. I don't have any really bad stuff. Um, I mean, you have some bad stuff. But you know what? Flawed release kind of takes the cake here. If we are keeping around Neville here, this is actually not a bad plan. Let's see if Medicinal Herbs works. It does. Flawed release quirk removed. We now have a perfect bounty hunter with no downsides. We'll see how long that lasts. But that's still pretty sweet. Let's keep going. Alright, and uh... Default party order. Thank you very much. So we're going into this fight. Um... Let's just pop all the torches. Just pop safety. all the torches. It's fine. Oh, and it's bloodsuckers. Okay. Maddening wine. It's not the worst. Just don't freak him out too much, okay? He still needs to get to camping town. Why? That's really, really rude. Okay, so now we're in a situation where these two are going to go next, and there's no way to stun them. So what we're going to do instead is start chopping up the people in the back, maybe? He's close. He's almost dead already. With that mentioned, we can probably retribute him. We've done it! Mark yourself. Repost is on. Um, We can bring this man forward and try to stab him with our uh, Plague Doctor. Oh, yes! Oh, bleed him! It worked! He's as, almost as good as dead. Not quite! He's still got, like, some things that are... Uh, he's still got, like, one HP. But it'd be good if he could just, like, not be alive any longer, honestly. Okay, he's dead next turn regardless. Don't give him the bad stuff. Oh! We just upgraded his stuff. Uh, we might actually have to throw him out. How much HP do you have now? Five? You know what? Just crush him. So that's a problem. Uh, that's a character that we will probably likely have to fire. Or that I'll feel like I need to fire anyway. Crunch him. Thank you. And part of that is because, like, I just, I really don't want to have to flip and deal with uh, too many people who are cursed up, man. It just, it's a lot of hassle. Okay, you on the other hand, you need to heal up or... What? <laughs> that was the worst. Okay, gather the blood. It's not a big problem. Just don't do the thing. 
Thank you for the resist. That could have been really ugly. Crush him. Thank you. Alrighty. Well, that was just all weird. What are you? Brought low and driven to the mud. Yes, please let me know what's behind this curio so that way I can... Strange presence is felt near the statue of worship. Um... You know what, since we're probably going to fire you anyway, what's Holy Water do? Or strength engulfs the hero. Plus 18% damage until camp. Well, now we know for the future, but uh, we're camping here because the boss is right up ahead and we can get some bigger buffs. Together. Oh, and there some heals and some stress over. relief. Like, that was all necessary. Uh, with that mentioned, does anyone here have like any like diseases of any kind that aren't particularly helpful? Because if they do, we can get rid of it. No, it doesn't seem like it. Um, okay. What do we want to do? We want to reduce... This man's... Stress. If we can. And we can. There are ways of doing so. Um, we have no means of stopping an ambush this time, though. Which kind of stinks. Alright, let's play it safe, then. Uh, I suggest that we get... Maintain equipment... We encourage our bounty hunter. Let's see. No one really needs a big heal right now. So if we can use something else with our six respite, this might not be a bad time to do it. How about we do dark strength um, and put that onto, I guess, our man at arms? On the off chance of a good riposte? And then, uh, let's see, what's more important here? Do we want to give someone plus three, five dodge or plus three speed? Or do we want to give somebody the ability to get, like, plus ten accuracy and five crit? Yeah, I think that's what we do. All right. It's go time. And ambush? No ambush. Very lucky. All right, well, we know that the boss is probably just down this way. Which is not a thrilling, you know, supposition for me as far as I'm concerned. Guys cleansed, and that gives us if money. I keep forgetting that it gives you money flower. instead of food. It's Other a little strange, but I'll take it. Okay. This should be the boss. Uh, after this, apparently. There's still this to go through. Maddening wine. This is a bad time for this. I'd rather you didn't. Okay, so things that we need to get rid of. Gatekeeper. Uh, is he human? He is not. Can we stun him? Not guaranteed, but it does knock him back. Um... And if it does stun him, that'd be nice. It's like a 75% chance. You know what? I'll bank on it. He resisted one of the two. That's fine. Um, in that case, then, could I get a knife stab on his face for a bleed? He's down to two HP left. One HP left? He's effectively at one HP now. Uh, if we retribute, he's dead. Yeah, that's fine. It took the entire party to do, but that's, as far as I'm concerned, like, understandable. Uh, pull this lazy bug forward so we can get a better chance at slapping him in the face multiple times. Gather the blood here does not bother me too much because he's already a, a blood-ridden mess. Pre-digestion. You're hitting the wrong boy. You resisted both. What a dude. Alright, well, in that case, then, seems I still can't get to the guy in the back, so here, how about we, like, stun him up? Good. Now, with that mentioned, uh, do we want to heal or do we want to mark? I suggest that we mark. If this mark works, not only does it re ooh, reduces the dodge. Okay, this is this is good. Smash him, Annihilate. and then it'll be up to our bounty hunter to do the last uh, the last honors here. Collect the bounty on this man, please. Oh, how did that not kill him like instantaneously? gather the blood no 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 okay good i was gonna say if that had given me the curse i would have been a little upset what are you oh you're normal okay unfortunate i would have liked you to stay a little bit more bloodlusty but that's okay take the blood take the money take the jade if possible um it does not seem like we're gonna need another shovel so there we go grab that that's okay i don't i don't i no longer need that invitation boss time we're as ready as we'll ever be, I guess. Uh, since we got some spare food. You have two. You have two. Three. 
Yeah. Okay, we're as healthy as we possibly can be. What happens if we give blood to these guys now? Plus 10 prot for three battles. 35 damage for three battles. Okay. Why don't we just do the same thing to you? Plus seven dodge and four speed. Okay. Well, everybody's had a little bit of a drink. It's fine. Okay. Siren time. The aquatic devils have remade the poor girl. Oh my in their gosh. Image. She's their queen, queen and their slave. And their slave. She is not very pretty. Um, that's not, that's, that doesn't matter all that much. Look, can she be debuffed? She can be. We gotta try. She's marked and debuffed. Fantastic. Okay. Um, stun chance is 50%. We gotta give it a shot. Nice. And then, uh, what's her bleed? 60% resist. Blight, not nearly so much. Noxious Blast it is. She's been blighted up as well. Oh, God. She gets two turns. No, you're hitting the wrong lady! Ah, uh, Lady, I hate you so much. So here's the problem. Death waits for the slightest lapse in Good resist. Um, she stole my dude. <laughs> Uh, how do we deal with this? Well, the fact that he, she's all marked up for only one extra round is a little frustrating, but we can still deal some damage to her. Uh, we also could start healing ourselves up, but I think it's just, it's more important to deal damage. So which one's going to deal more? Abyssal Artillery it is. We kill her, we're good to go. I fight for love, amazing. It's a shame that you're all like, you know... Oh my god, that hurts. I just realized he does extra damage to humans! Um... Protect him, please. Pressure crash. That sucks. It's just a lot of stress, though. Okay, I thought that was going to be a lot worse. Nauseous Blast. Get that damage up. Eight damage or turn? It's not bad. Devour's bad. Oh, God. Bleed on everybody. And we're back. Okay, so... You're hurting. You need to heal yourself. You crit for four? That's not good enough. <laughs> okay, you on the other hand. Uh, you need to, like, legitimately retribute at this point. Because anytime she does a global attack like that again, you want to be slapping her. You need to move forward. Don't do it again. Song of Desire. You are hitting the wrong man. Stop. Oh, the resist is great. The resist is so good. Battlefield Medicine. Heal yourselves both up. Nicely done. Okay, try that again. Devour? Get slapped. Alright, so she's not blighted up any longer. Song of Desire. I really wish you would stop hitting the people I don't want you to hit. Thank you for the resist. Okay, Vulnerability Hex. At this point, the damage is going to be worth it. Devour. Okay. That's her second attack this time around. We got some bleeds. It's only one bleed per round, though. So I don't think that this is going to go badly. We, we've got this fight. Like, if we keep resisting all these bad debuffs, we're totally fine. S smash. Down at 27 already, holy crap. Collect the bounty. Oh, it hurts! She's almost done. She is done. She's at effective 9 HP. Dead. 100% toasted. Get out of here, lady. Oh, just heal yourself up. Maybe you'll get lucky. Wait, hold on. You got bandages? Spend them? Heal yourself up. Maybe we can stick around and get some more loot. Uh, while you're at it, you know what? Battlefield Medicine. Look at that. And she's dead. Why does she have two Crusader Charms? I mean, like, don't get me wrong. I like it, but... Oh, right, we're out of food. We couldn't do it if we tried. Okay, we're gonna grab this. We're gonna grab the other one as well. And we're done. Okay, that's fine. We're out. That's all I wanted to do anyway. Uh, okay. So we got... Our money back, I think, more or less. Yeah, yeah, we, we effectively split even with that one. We're a little shy of it, honestly, but uh, it could have been a lot worse. We got the Mercurial Salve, though. That's the big shit. Having that's going to mean we're doing a lot more damage to the people I really want to deal damage to. Cove Adventure, Cove Tactician, and Hard Skin. Fantastic stuff. Wow. That was a good mission. Like, that was easy. That was fine. 
a day long awaited. Word of our predicament has spread and a new crop of aspiring corpses step from the stagecoach. Six more recruits than usual. Well, Macy, I know that I gave you some upgrades and stuff, but like now that you're cursed, it's not... It's not that good. Like... I'd really rather not. <laughs> like Vitalis here, the fact that he's got the Crimson Curse, it's it's okay. We'll deal with it because we can manage to work with all that crap. But um, we have got so many options. And not a one of them is a proper healer. Uh, me. Oh, wait, there is one. Hey, Roussel. How you doing? Beast hater, natural swing, vengephobia. What? If it's bright out, he gets scared easier. What the heck is going on? <laughs> he's actually worth keeping around, though. Like, he's he's uh, he's experienced. In fact, so experienced, it actually makes this look bad. I'm sorry, Macy. Slumped shoulders, wild Bring eyes. Roussel with us from I'm here on out. Fantastic. Dead. This one is no more good to us. Uh, how's Lucy doing? Lucy has been upgraded. Lucy has some stuff. Missed the spot, minus 1% crit. Yeah. Uh, we do have another Houndmaster in here. Montague. Montague is a lot worse. Yeah, we're not touching Montague. Uh, how about McDowell? What do you have? Plus 5 accuracy? Melee skills? You don't have any melee skills, lady. What are you, what are you doing? With that with that little thing there. Precise striker. What's Theon doing? Oh, right. Okay. Theon's got problems. <laughs> But at least it's not the Crimson Curse. Speaking of the curse, we only have uh, we still only have three people affected by it. That's okay. Like that, we're doing fine on that front, which is nice. Um, so here's what I'm thinking: we're a couple grand deeper than we used to be, but we're still at sixty-eight thousand gold. That's a lot. After that boss fight, we have got one of the best trinkets in the game, like bar none, for this next session of the game that we want to do. There's. There's so much I can think of that would be helpful with Mercurial Salve. It's gonna be a great time. Do we have the lineup for this? Like, do we? Like, if we go in to this, we bring along Malibus, who would have, like, reasonable gear at that point. He'll slap people to pieces. We bring along, uh, Paris same you know deal same channel simnil and Grandcore. like we'll have a reasonable lineup at that point one that's capable of exploring without dying horribly uh mind you you are like gonna have a bad time but you know what no no no, no. this is still fine like urkenbor here is going to be great i have no no doubt about that zero doubts and because we'll be able to camp at least once, we can bloody shroud. Yeah, I think I... Like, you know what? We've got to do it. We're going to at least check out what the Baron's place is like. Next episode. But for now, thank you all for watching. I hope you folks enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit the like button down below. And if you guys want to see some more, subscribe for some more videos. I'll see you folks next time.